Hey everyone, welcome to the Horror Show. I'm Cecil Laird. I'm Andrew Mercer. I'm Ethan Fuego Shia. Back with some new trailer reactions for you guys. Well, new to us. <laughs> there, uh, most of them are kind of old at this point, um, you know. But uh, that is what it is. We had a bit, very busy October, and we've been doing some other stuff for the beginning of November. So. Bear with us while we get back on track with the trailer reactions and stuff, but uh, today we're going to be starting with Winchester, which, Fuego, what is this one? Well, now it's called Winchester, the House Ghosts Built. It was originally just called Winchester, and I, I don't know if I'd like the hyphenated little thing they're going for, but uh, basically, uh, uh, Winchester is this lady played by Helen Mirren, who is the, if I'm not mistaken, the uh, surviving widow of the man who invented the Winchester rifle, and so she had this mansion in Northern California that she lived in, and that she was certain was being haunted by ghosts of people killed by these rifles, and so uh, to ward them off, she was like in a constant state of uh, just building additions, and all kinds of like hallways that lead to nowhere, and craziness like that and she, this continued until like pretty much right before she died and the house is actually tourable now and is considered haunted in all actuality so this is based on true events type stuff um these are kind of hit and miss for me sometimes but uh, i'm very curious with helen mirren especially involved so i Jake, think it could Jason be good i mean i don't know i uh I, here's the thing. This actually played before a movie that I watched, but um, I was you I was watching it with eyes. Brittany. I did. I averted my eyes and I closed my ears and started singing myself. So I uh, I did not see it. So I'm excited to finally watch it. So here we go. In three, two, one. Winchester, the house that ghosts built. Ugh. This gargantuan seven-story structure was built on the orders of a grieving widow, Sarah Winchester. We're worried about her sanity. Right, here we go. Gargantuan seven story structure with no apparent rhyme or reason. Each maze of halls more confusing than the next. It's under never ending construction. It was built on the orders of a grieving widow. Sarah Winchester is the majority shareholder of the Winchester Repeating Arms Company. You want to take it away from her. You're worried about her sanity, Dr. Price. Do you believe in ghosts, Doctor? I do not believe in anything I cannot see or study. potential but the trailer was just kind of man yeah the trailer was just kind of so so but yeah i agree i see potential too i i really like the uh the mazeness of it you know mm -hmm. it's fascinating it makes me wonder if they actually filmed it at the winchester mansion itself if they allowed them to do it probably not but um sure they'd be cool if they did <laughs> i mean they it looks like they got some exterior shots i don't know if they built a, a replica or whatever but yeah that, that would make sense if they just did like some drone stuff of the actual mansion and then just built sets for the inside yeah but, uh but it's really interesting I, I like the idea like a maze of a house you mm -hmm. know andrew cool. what did you think i think it's cool uh it's kind of an interesting idea but uh yeah the the trailer did not kind of hook you in on the ghost i don't know if they're waiting for a big reveal they only really showed one, mm -hmm. and in the most haunted house in history, I would assume we would have seen more than one. Right. And yeah, we need more uh, of a tease than that. I <laughs> like the, uh, they did do the backstory justice. They kind of set it up. Um, you don't really know what to expect from this Winchester lady or whatever. So, Sorry, um, Winchester. She kind of has, I don't know, she kind of seems like she's clued into this stuff too much. Mm-hmm. 
Uh, like she knows a little more than the average bear, so well, she's the one who's lived there all this time. And she's the one who's convinced there's evil spirits there. So. Well, it's just something where it almost seems like she's cool with it. Like they they can be walking around, they don't bother her, and mm -hmm. but they'll bother everybody else. Yeah. To me, that's like a they're on her side thing. So I don't know. Um, she's desensitized to the situation. Maybe, maybe something like that. Here for so stinking well, long. no, what I heard, um, I don't know. I thought I heard it from you, Fuego, but I guess not. I guess the. The reason that she was continuously building onto the house was because she felt like specific spirits were after her. Oh, yeah. And yeah. it would confuse them mm -hmm. as to how to get to her. Yeah. So All the tall she's not nowhere. like gotten used to it. She's constantly on the run in her mm -hmm. own house, essentially, mm -hmm. is, she, is the way I understood but it. But she's at least become accustomed to that unease and stuff is what I, I mean. Or, or maybe she feels a little bit better because the construction is being continually done. And maybe. Well, to me, I was just kind of thinking maybe she's bringing all, the, all these people in for construction and all that stuff and just turning them into ghosts and that's why they haunt the house. Uh -huh. Oh, well, it could be. But I that's I mean I, I doubt thought, she'd I get thought, very many construction crews after the first couple. <laughs> very true. <laughs> but um, I don't know. That was it looks cool. Um the Don't one shot. the one guy we saw, uh, the creature or the ghosty guy looked pretty cool. Mm -hmm. So um, I'm hoping there's a little more on that end, but um, probably be PG thirteen and yeah, you know, yeah, it does just look like that. go halfway there. But uh, that was yeah. Right in the middle. Yeah. I'm right. fascinated by the story though, so for that reason I'll I'll definitely check it out. So. Cool. All right, well, let us know in the comments down below, what did you guys think of this trailer for Winchester, the house that ghosts built? Ugh, I hate that freaking title so much. Mm. Uh, but, yeah, let us know what you thought. Did you enjoy it? Are you interested? Are you going to see this one? Until next time, I've been Cecil Laird. I'm Ange Mercer. Make sure you click the link in the description box, you guys. That is to our merch store. They are running huge sales all November and December long. I believe by the time this trailer reaction goes up, we're going to be smack dab in the middle of their Black Friday sale. Mm. So uh, make so sure you pop. check that out. Or I think this week might be the pre-Black Friday sale, and then next week is the Black Friday sale. Anyway, sales all Black November Friday. long. Yeah. There is a post-Black Friday sale, <laughs> uh, which is the cyber sale, you know, to go with Cyber Monday. So, yeah. Monday, Monday, Guys, Monday, all Monday, weekend, Monday. or all November and December leading up to Christmas, they're running sales to help you guys out. So uh, we added a really cool design with the uh, the new logo that was um, drawn by Rob Cordry. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, I'm excited about that. You guys can go, and anything you get on our store is supporting the channel because we get a little kickback. So yes, we appreciate you. Exactly. Thank you guys very much for watching, and remember, stay, stay scared! scared.